Hello, I'm Karen Fairley, Executive Director of the Center for Safer Schools in the North Carolina Department of Public Instruction. This month, I want to spotlight behavioral threat assessment as it relates to school safety. Behavioral threat assessment and management provides a proactive approach for identifying individuals who might pose a threat to themselves or others, and for providing intervention before an incident occurs. The center hosts free online school behavioral threat assessment and management trainings. House Bill 605, which was signed into law in July, provides for threat assessment teams at all North Carolina public schools beginning in the 2024-25 school year. Those multidisciplinary teams, which include people with backgrounds in counseling, instruction, administration, and law enforcement, conduct threat assessments in a public school unit when threatening behavior has been communicated and or when a student is engaged in behavior that can be a potential harm to themselves or others. House Bill 605 includes the Center for Safer Schools developing guidance for threat assessment teams for public schools. This guidance is developed by collecting information and best practices from schools with existing threat assessment teams and consulting with relevant state government agencies. Our responsibility is to provide training, technical assistance, and resources to public school units. We want parents in North Carolina to feel secure in sending their children to school, knowing that the center is supporting public school units in their safety efforts.